Hi, beautiful people. Welcome back to the channel. Today I've got something so interesting for you, if I say so myself. And, well, you might or you might not know that I'm very gullible uh, when I see a, um, a advertisement on Facebook, then I'm like, hmm, that looks interesting. I have to try that out. So, this time I caved in and I did because what I'm going to show you might be very interesting and might as well be a new hobby for other people so <clears throat> well this is the box it came in a box um, I'm gonna explain to you all afterwards I've got mine from the Netherlands and they're pride quite expensive but you can find them on other websites uh, in other countries um, but I will explain that all to you later and that might uh, be much better for your wallet because uh, yeah in the Netherlands they were a little too expensive but um, the main shop is in in Prague so um I'm taking everything out. Yeah, box empty, box is empty. So, <clears throat> let us start with the smaller one. So here I've got all the explanation in, in um, Dutch. And I hope I will be able to explain the the working of this because it's, it's very new to me so this one comes from the website oh my dots in the Netherlands so actually what you do you get so this will be the end result I I chose two old masters so this is the Mona Lisa as we all can see a very good rendering of Mona Lisa so, what you do is, it comes on a canvas, you see all these dots, and they're all different sizes, see, so all different sizes of, of dots, so, what you have to do is they send it to you with a bunch of markers so you got a, a normal marker a black marker uh, this is the same one but then you've got a very fine one so um, you use these to fill in the dots. So what you do actually is just color in. And yeah, the more precise you are, the more your work will look something like this. I know it's not very colorful, but I think like um, filling in these little dots will give me some... Ah, I don't know, some relaxation and everything. So, um, yeah. So, I've got the Mona Lisa. Then I've got another bag. So, per painting, they send you... Oh, I've got it. More black, black um, markers. And one very fine marker. So, the next one that I have is a bigger one. Oh, I'm really curious. So, the one, the other one is the Milkmaid. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, I'm so excited for this. This is something really new. And on the Oh My Dots website, they tell you like, are you tired of diamond painting? Do you want to do something different? And I'm like, yeah, I might try this. 
Oh, so this is a bigger size. Uh, it doesn't really state the sizes. Um, but yeah, of course, you can't see anything right. You do, you can make out a little bit what is go it's going to be. But uh, that's it, essentially. You fill in the dots with your marker and then at the end you have like this black and white uh, version of your favorite old master. Well, these are not really my favorite old masters, but just saying. Um, so, uh, as I said, I found this on... Um, on the Netherlands but let me show you something I'm gonna take you off the stand and get you to my messy desk look 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 I'm uh, she's really coming she's really beautiful anyways wait um let me show you so I'm going to open another tab wait um uh, what's the name again mm. dotting maybe i can look for it like that dotting no that's not it i was so prepared and i i had the website somewhere and i can't find it um oh my dots let's go there uh. mm. I can't find it. <laughs> I was going to show you and I can't find it. Uh, and do I still have the address? Um, what was it? Prague? Nah. Oh my god, I suck at this. Uh, maybe I can find it in my history. Uh, blah, blah, blah. History. Wait, uh, uh, it did come very quickly, I must tell you. So, I uh, was looking for the master class, round drill, oh my god, I watched too much, too much YouTube. Um, dot build from photo diamond bank kunda betalen liefering. Okay, build from photo. Yeah, so I think I found it. So this is actually the website. Um, so they have got diamond paintings and everything. The main store is in Prague, so they've got painting by numbers. They've got dotting uh yeah in uh in german it's called punkt malerei malerei um so and the prices are so different from the shop in the in the so you you've got all these types of you can put in a uh, photo uh yeah they've got baby yoda look at that so cute so, um, but I'm showing you this to tell you where you can get this. So, you can get it in um, these countries. Uh, Deutschland does send it to um, Austria, to... Um, so, Germany sends it to Austria, Switzerland. Um, uh, they've got a UK store as well. And I think they also sent to UK, as far as I could tell. Uh, UK, what am I saying? So UK also sends to, yeah, UK, USA. So 
it can and there I must tell you the prices are much cheaper so if you look for example uh, in euros this is only five euros um, bigger pieces so um, yeah but unfortunately if I want to have some more of these I have to um, order them from the shop in the Netherlands and, and there it's it's more expensive I don't know why but um, this is the main store so um, and there everything is of course in Czech and I I I don't understand the word but um, I will put the link to the UK U, uh, UK USA store and to the one in uh, Germany I will put it in um, the description so in, in the UK it's paintingfromphoto.com um, and in Germany it's uh, Malen uh, yeah I don't know I'm gonna put it in the in the description so there you go that's what I uh, the interesting thing that I had hi birdies hello hello so um, but that's not all. That's not all for today. I'm gonna put them away. I'm gonna roll them together. The canvas is actually has got a very nice feel to it. And I'm going to hide the markers because my my daughter she would be one. To steal them and I don't want to have them stolen because they're especially for this so uh, there so the next thing that I have for you is a review Ooh, so the little mermaid by Medusa the doll maker is finished and I am so thrilled with how it looks it's absolutely gorgeous 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 stunning ah my god um i wish there were shops that had the same type of rendering um so yeah beautiful and i had the one with the special drills um, for the moon, I had some other special drills that they uh, gave with the, um, with the kits. Oh my god. There's one thing that I will... Yeah, I will, I will talk to you about this later. So, um, I put down some diamond dots um, special drills, ABs, in the moon, in the crescent moon. So... Yeah, I like this better. Then there was this type of purplish. I don't know if you can see there in the seaweed or what is it? Corals. Um, there were special drills that you had to sprinkle in the tail of the mermaid. See, there's a little fish. There are little fishes there swimming. She's holding a starfish in her hand she's absolutely gorgeous she's oh i love this so much and i loved working on it very much one thing that i do not really like about the canvases of diy moon shop and it's not the first time that i have the same problem is that the glue is not so strong so uh, you have to handle it very carefully because they tend to move or, yeah, you can easily lose drills. And um, that's something like when you put something on there. Um, eh, uh, I should, yeah, I'm, I'm going to take my diamond painting pen and just look what, what I mean. Oh, my arm. 
Wait. Uh, try to. Whoop! Try to show you guys what I mean. Like there. Do you see here? Um, I must have been not careful enough. So the drills they did move. And um, yeah, that's something. So the good thing is that you can easily um, slide them when you want to straighten, but you have to be very careful um, when you handle this type of diamond painting of DIY Moon Shop because the drills are not really on there for life. And I'm going to show you what I mean. Like, um, if you would ever think of uh, hanging this uh, in a place where, um, oh, I dropped my diamond painting pen, in a place where there's uh, lots of people passing by, like uh, on a staircase or anything, um, then I would suggest that you, or, um, uh, oh, seal it, that you seal it, or you frame it. Because, um, let me show you what I mean. Like, um, I already showed you the ones that I have. So that's one and that's one. And for that one, I didn't lose any drills. So everything is still on there. That one has lost like two drills, but it might as well be my own fault. Like, um, and yeah, she's hanging in front of my um, heat, my heating, my heater. So maybe that's what's drying out. Uh, I should change where I put her. But uh, those will not lose any more drills. So, and I'm planning on hanging the little mermaid there. So you see that's not going to be a problem. But let me take you to another one of Medusa the Dollmaker. So, we are now standing in front of the Chesh Cheshire or Cheshire, Ch Cheshire cat. And this one has been hanging here from like almost since the beginning of my diamond painting career. And it has lost numerous diamonds drills numerous like and why because i'm now on the stairs so it's hanging here where everyone of our home passes by wait there was a place where there were like a ginormous amount that were missing but um there uh wait it's difficult to to point it out there are drills missing uh there's a drill missing like and and especially in the face drills that just came off and um yeah it's because of yeah people touching the when you come down the stairs of course sometimes you you just put your hand on the wall like that and um, yeah sometimes they put their hand on the diamond painting also the dumb dumb thumb tags sometimes fell out of the wall and I I have to put some other down as well because I see this won't last a long time so I will um yeah where where was it there are drills missing so it's a lot it's a beautiful painting and when you look at it from Woo! oh my god <laughs> when you look at it from far away it doesn't really show that there are drills missing um, but yeah, 
so that's what uh, if you want to hang it somewhere on the wall next to your stairs um, just seal it or um, or frame it because you will lose drills of course so back here so um, yeah that was some of the things that I wanted to talk to you about so um, remember sealing or framing or if you want to take the risk you can always um, hold on to the walking legend that comes with the package and that way you can always um, go back to your legend and see what colors that are missing maybe i will do that with uh, for the Chesh cheshire cat but um <laughs> Right now I'm way too busy to, to be doing a, like, a type of job like that. So yeah, but I, oh, she's so beautiful. Look at her. She's so beautiful. I'm so totally in love. Oh, the rendering, the rendering is just so good. So, um, yeah. I wish there were more shops that had this type of rendering. I don't know if it's hand rend hand charted or computer rendered, but it's it's um like the lines are not just one color. It's it's so many different colors, so much confetti, but that makes it that that it has like like a natural flow. It's not like just lines it's it's just flowy and yeah it's perfect so that was it for today hope you liked this video if you did give it a thumbs up on your way out and uh, remember to subscribe hit the bell to get a notification and thank you so so much for watching hope you have a wonderful rest of your day and i will see you in the next video bye